So welcome back and today we're going to look at an SMedic conversion which Cypher has made and it's using some turrets for armaments and this is a Tristan from the game EVE Online and as you can see it's uh, like a frigate I think it is a frigate so um, yeah I'm just going to have a little look around take a look at this ship here so he's put the engines in the right place and uh, like I say, the model's pretty good. It's quite a small model conversion. Everyone tends to make things really big. So that's quite fresh. As you can see, a lot of detail gone in with the wedges, I guess. And it looks like he's all hardened hull, or hardened black. So uh, I'm going to see how this thing performs. Ah, he's saying it's one-to-one -one scale, so, yeah, lovely. I thought it might be when I was looking at just flying around it. I figured it might be one-to-one, -one. so, yeah, that's pretty awesome. Hmm. Ah, so he's got a few guns mounted there as well as all the turrets. Very nice. So today we're looking at the Tristan and we're going to get Cypher to give it one click against the water gel. Okay, so one click gets two blocks. One second gets about just under ten blocks. Okay, so we're going to fire for thirty seconds. seconds and he's up to 50 blocks there you go that's 30 seconds so looking at the score there he's done just over 50 blocks of penetration in 30 seconds I forgot to let him shoot his missiles so Boom. Uh, nice little missile hole there. There we go. Let's do the one click test. So here we are, one click test. Let's see how he does. <laughs> okay, so let's have a look there. He's got pierced the first layer and damaged the, damaged the inner layer there. So yeah, let's get on to the bobby fights. Okay, here we go for round one got insane lock on I swear he locked on backwards then yeah so the AI just locked on a BB missile whilst not facing his target Cypher isn't moving this isn't good Cypher you need to start moving buddy buddy you really need to um oh the missile took him out what oh man Let's see if we can try that again. Let's take a look at the damage quickly before we restart the round. So, uh, a BB rocket just sort of exploded there. That shouldn't have done the damage, but it seems to have put a hole through, which it got a shot in. But yeah, so um, I'm going to give him another go, because anyone that fails the first round now, I think I'm going to let them have another go. So we're just getting set up again. I think he was actually typing in the chat. That's what he said to me. So uh, I'm giving him a chance to go and activate all his turrets. Just to make sure everything's okay. Obviously it's a brand new ship. So it just needed to re re be reset. And then we're going to get it on. <laughs> so round two begins. It's got a few hits in on him. Oh, he's losing hull. He's still in the fight. Oh. Come on, buddy, you can do it. He's still alive. His turrets aren't doing much, though. Oh, 
that rocket is going to hit him. It might just go poof. I'm trying to keep an eye on everything. Oh, he's going back up to meet the missile. No, don't go up there. Oh, the missile's still too slow. We've got additive velocity on with a 1.0 multiplayer. I don't know if I had to set it higher than that to actually see an effect. But then they weren't traveling all that fast when they started. Oh dear, he's being chased by so many missiles. And he hasn't broken the shields on it yet. Oh no, more missiles for him. Just check I'm still cloaked. Yes. Oh boy. <clears throat> that missile launcher is going to go off again in a minute. The trigger's tanking him. Still firing, so he's not down. He's surviving really well. The key is getting behind him. If you can get behind him, that's it. It's all over. Oh, is he? He's dead in the water. All right, first things first. Let's deactivate the trigger. Oh no! Right. So anyway, this is what it looked like before it got all. Oh nice, the shields came back online. Haha. <laughs> so yeah, um he got carved open by the looks of it. I don't know where exactly the core was. Let's have a look. Ah, the core's at the back there. Let's have a look around. Oof. That'll do it. Hmm. Okay, so yeah, good fight. Cheers for bringing it down. It's a nice model, and it'll be going in the Hall of Smedit. So every Sunday, I'll be looking at uh, model conversions or ships that were made using uh, SMEDIT. So uh, just to let people know, bring them to me in the same way that people have been bringing them just for any old, you know, your normal ships. So yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.